Hello everybody and welcome to another one of my tutorials where in this time I will assist you with putting mods on Doom. Now, Doom was released in 1993. It's a pretty old game. But what keeps it up is the gameplay of course, it's timeless and the mods. In this video I'll show you how to put the mods. You will need three basic things. First, the wads. The wads are what keeps the game information. As you can see, I have him right here, inside this folder, WOD collection, which I will put in the links so you can download them. The WODs have all the information, the music, the, the maps, everything. Next thing you'll need is, what I have right here, is a source port. Now, what this will do is replace the original engine, which is really old, only supports a small resolution, and adapt it to the modern days, give it a full HD look, um, um, improve the texture look, everything, it will make it look prettier. And third, you will need the mod itself. Now, the first thing you want to do is download JZ Doom. I am aware that there are others to, that uh, also work, but I work with JZ Doom, it's the best one in my opinion. All you have to do is download it, the, like so, the recent version, and it will open a zip file which will have these simple files. All you need to do is copy. I might replace them, I don't, I don't need it, I already have in here. Replace files and there you go. These are the files you'll need. Next is the walls, as you can see I have in here. Uh, all you need to do is copy the Doom ones. I don't think the other ones work, perhaps TNT. But uh, copy these ones. And you'll have the two walls. Lastly, you'll want to download the mods. In this case, I will be showing you with Brutal Doom, which is the best mod ever created. You go to the download section and download Brutal Doom. It's really simple. All you need to do is click here. And it will give you a file, which is this one. It will have an extension of PK3. I also downloaded um, Doom Metal Volume 3, which will give a new soundtrack, which is much better than the original. Now I will show you the difference between the original and the modded version. Note that I will also put a link to the um, to the configuration file so you can configure the mouse look, the textures and all that, but I will give you with my control so you can just simply start Doom and don't have to configure anything. So here goes. Uh, you, here you'll see first the uh, original Doom, how it was, and the modded version, so you can see the differences.
fuck yourself!
Yourself. 